Sienna Kaczmarczyk, the Australian who finished in 29th place last week here at the Solidarity Cup. Yeah, 31st after the short program and a top score of 75.41 last week. And we'll skate the free program to Hakari. Australia's Sienna Kaczmarczyk. Big piece of music. Huge piece of music, and I'm sure the impact will be felt all the more as the season progresses and more triples are landed. And interestingly, Sienna competed at the Sea Open Trophy in Singapore at the start of September. She competed last week at the Solidarity Cup, and again now, and that it's difficult to maintain that level of, of peak fitness, not just peak fitness, but also the, the adrenaline that is required. And expelled and consumed to compete and so difficult for these skaters down under other new zealand or australia to get enough international competition to compare find out where do i fit in europe and north america you have to get these competitions to gauge your progress and where you're at and you might know very well where you're at in your own country but you need to get out and of course that requires a lot of resources both financial and time yeah absolutely we spoke with her teammate you know Potopenko, the fellow Australian who competed last week, as we see these opening jumping passes. And 
explaining just you know the financial commitment it takes to compete at this level and is huge. Difficult series of turns with the back rocker changing edge and then the second salco. Yeah, these jumps at the top of the program too far back in the heel. Not enough air time, so the lifting off the ice was just a little less than what she needs. You want to have spare time in the air. Not too much, but you want to have spare time in the air so that if something goes off, you can still make a minor correction. It should be just automatic. You don't have to think about it too quickly. You need to be quick in rotation and have enough air time to get all the way around and a little bit too far back on the heel in the beginning of the program. It seemed to settle down partway through, as we see here, a nice bracket back outside edge. I put the double axle, gets around to the double toe, so it continued to improve as the program went on and although this will not be a score that sienna will want to see it, the opportunity for learning how to cope with the exhaustion of competing week on week that too another aspect yeah. for it brings dividends learning. down the road 63.87 and a personal best is 75.41 so quite a bit off that score that'll put sienna currently in the fifth place but she can't really put a value on lessons learned that's 100.84 for the Competition so far, that'll put Sienna currently in the second place. And these young skaters don't know that value yet, but they will find out rather shortly. 